I got interested in soil judging um, when I took the soil evaluation class. Didn't really know what I was getting into at first, and uh, last year was my first year, and uh, went up to North Platte, learned a lot, and that's when I really got interested into it. Um, well, we spend one week up in South Dakota. Um, we spend several days looking at different soil sites they have set up for us around the area, and just learning in those days, and it's just a really good learning experience as a team. Um, and then the last couple days of our trip are actually the competition where we look at several different soil pits and evaluate those for competition. Well, there's a lot of different things that we look at in the soil to evaluate it. Um, some of the most basic things we look at is the texture and the structure of the soil. Um, there's also different special features sometimes, like sodium content or different things that'll affect the soil like that. Um, so those are the basic things that we're evaluating while we're there. Things I get out of soil judging class, I learn how to classify soils, I learn how to describe them, I learn how they relate to the environment and everything that you know, goes on with them. And um, learn how you can you know, use them, how they apply to like agriculture and all kinds of other things. I think the soil judging really helps me to um, understand the soil in a more detailed way and understand how that's going to affect productivity, which um, just the management of the soil in farming practices, um, all those things are affecting how you manage the soil, the texture and the structure. And um, By understanding it more detailedly, I think it'll help me be a better management of soil in the future in whatever I end up doing. Everything can start with the soils. It's one of the first things you look at if you have to remediate the soil. I mean, if it's contaminated, you have to know what type of soil you're dealing with in the first place before you can even begin to think about trying to fix any type of problems there may be. Yeah, I think it's just a really great opportunity to really um, understand the soil that you work with. The soil is obviously a very big part of farming and agriculture, and so we really need to understand that and be able to manage it well. Um, it's a very valuable resource, and so um, I think just understanding the properties of the soil, the physical properties, the chemical properties, and how that can be managed to have um, better productivity, sustainability, um, to maintain that so that we can have good yields, all those things play into it. <laughs>